Well, I'm really glad our school got the chance to come to base camp today. It's an opportunity for our kids to try new things, to build confidence um, by seeing themselves learn and succeed in things that they haven't tried before. And they never get a chance to do rock climbing or archery or team building. And it's the beginning of the school year. They're getting to work together, build teamwork, build a, build a rapport with each other. And um, I think this, the students are really benefiting today, but I think we'll see the benefits down the line um, later on in the school year when they're asked to do group projects and things of that nature. I think that the teamwork skills that they're getting out of a day like today will really show. One of the main things you get to focus on there is being a team and building new friendships. My favorite thing would have to be the high ropes course because we got to go up high and the fact that it took a while to get up there and then and then we went down it felt like you were flying almost when they let you down. Yep. That was what I liked the most, feeling like I was flying. I was nervous at first but after trying it I found I liked it and would like to go back again if I had the opportunity. Now I know that if I can do that I can pretty much do anything I need to in school. These students are benefiting not just on that day from the challenging experiences and that seems to carry over to the classroom and it's helped a ton with our group of students here. Yeah, it's helped like to know that like I can persevere through things and like knowing that like just because there's a wall in front of me doesn't mean I can't get over it. I know some of the kids said that you know they're tackling bigger and tougher projects in the in the classroom as groups and when they do that they already have that kind of that tie or that unity with some of the other fellow students that they had from that base camp experience and so those groups are running smoother. It's really great to see them learn something and become good at it all in the span of 15 or 20 minutes and you see the kids helping each other and some of them are faster learners than others and the kids that learn quickly really want to help the other ones learn. Uh, so it's great. The staff was very welcoming and greeting the second that we arrived at base camp. They greeted us at the door. They took control, took the kids under their under their wing and showed them this is the repertoire that we're going to be doing for the day. This is the fun things we're going to be doing and kind of set them at ease, kind of squash some of their fears right away and told them they'll be having some fun and being challenged to their utmost. So it, it, the staff were very supportive and communicative. They talked to us, talked us through what we can do to help support our students too. Oh, they were so fun. They're all fun crew. They're all really nice. They were really nice. Yeah. yeah. It was a quick commute from White Bear right over to, right by the airport there. The bus driver had no problems getting to the, you know, the location right by Fort Snelling. We used to travel across the St. Croix River to a Wisconsin camp and uh, that was a it was a lot more expensive for transportation. And the kids, you know, would get a little antsy on that long bus ride, so it's nice for us to have something even close to home here. I can see the value in it for any level, you know, K through 12. Um, the kids that we had were ninth and 10th graders, and some of them were having fun like an elementary, you know, kid. And so I can see any level, any student benefiting from base camp. Yeah, I'm glad I went. I've actually been wanting to go back. So I don't actually want to try the ropes again. It's pretty fun and it's a great experience. Would you go back to base camp if you had the opportunity? Definitely.